Okay, you guys, you're never gonna guess where I'm going. I'm gonna go get vaccinated! They had an opening for three of us, so me, my mom, and my dad are gonna go get vaccinated right now. We're getting the Pfizer. It's a shot girl summer, baby. Vaccination station. I'm just excited because apparently if you bring your vaccination card to Krispy Kreme, you can get free donuts. Literally, you can go every day until the end of the year, so you know where to find me. I don't like going to the doctor very much. I like legitimately cry when I get shots. One time I got my finger pricked. This was like a couple years ago. I started crying and squeezing it because it hurt. And then the nurse started freaking out because she's like, don't squeeze it, more blood's gonna come out. And I was like, but it hurts. And then when I was in middle school, I got knee surgery and she was giving me my IV. She missed my vein and my arm started swelling up. And then my mom gets really queasy with anything like medical like that. So she saw passed out. I thought she died. I've never seen anybody pass out before. I was just like crying my eyes out and I was like, Ever since then, it's just been a horrible experience with shots. So this was really painless. The guy was so nice. It was so fast. Go get your shots. Go get vaccinated. We are only vaccination nation over here. Look at this. I've got a battle scar. I feel good. I feel like we're doing a good thing. And it makes me so happy to see like other people coming in here to get their vaccinations. We're all in this together. Now we're at the Japanese market. I'm going to go get some ice cream because I deserve it. And I want some alcohol because I deserve it. You gotta wait three days before you can drink, says apparently. Who? Um, says like doctors. You cannot make the rules. It's ice cream time! My dad has literally not stopped talking since he got the vaccine. I don't know what was in his vaccine. All right, let's play the quiet game, kids. <laughs> nope. I lost. Help. cry when I get shots when I'm 25. Gentle hands. Thank you. <laughs> See, I should do my own lashes. See, I got gentle hands. <laughs> freezing right now but we are headed out i need to go get a covid test um for something coming up i don't have any symptoms or anything this is just like a formality check and i just want to be extra careful before this next step of things happen so you guys are gonna have to stay tuned but let's go we've got a 45 minute drive right now so Oh my god, I look like a toe, a literal toe. You know it's too early to be awake when you can visibly see the moon. Make sure your name and date of birth are correct on the label. Uh, yes. Yeah, you see that door next to the testing zone uh -huh. sign? Yes. Alright, now the, there's a parking spot in front of that door. I want you to go straight and make a left into that parking spot. Don't pass the door. Don't go around the can or any of that. You I almost missed the parking spot like you said not to do. Hi. Good morning, how are you? Good, how are you? I'm good. So did they have you check the labels, make sure you're laying back there? Yes. Okay. All right, you're gonna do 10 seconds second of motion in each nostril. You're gonna put your head back. Then you're gonna do 10 seconds each nostril. Go deep enough to where it's uncomfortable, but not too deep to where it's <laughs> Okay. <laughs> Okay, then break that 
Should this thing be like really wet or no? Is it really wet? No. Is it not? It kind of looks a little bit dry. I mean, I just want to like make sure. Needs to be safe on the safe side. Okay. So eight, nine, ten. Eight, nine, ten. Oh. Okay. Thank you. I feel so violated. Uh. <laughs> I've tickled my brain. I am unwell. <laughs> now I am getting myself a treat along with my parents. Hi, um, can I get a venti pikes please? And can I get a grande vanilla sweet cream cold brew? A double shot over ice? Alrighty, does it order the correct on screen? Yes. Alrighty, thank you so much. I'll see you at the window for 985. Thank you. I'm just sunbathing right now. Or burning my corneas, you tell me. Hi, how are you doing? Hi, good. How about you? Good, thank you. It's just going to be 9 Okay. Okay. How are you doing? Good? I'm tired, yeah, but this will help. Yeah. Well, you are? Thank you. Of course. Have a great day. You too. My barista looked like Weathen. If you guys know DJs, he literally looked like him. I'm still not going to tell you guys what's happening yet. I think you're going to have to wait, you know, just to build the suspense. I feel like most of you guys already know if you follow me on Instagram. Okay, let's go home, down this coffee, and then I'm gonna work out. <sighs> All right, I look like a hot mess right now. What is going on here? So, I was gonna wait till tomorrow morning to tell you guys some vital information. But I currently have my alarm set for 3.45 and 3.50 a.m. tomorrow morning. Tomorrow, a new adventure starts. I am so grateful and over the moon and I don't even know how to explain it, but I am packing up my things and I am short term moving to Hawaii. I don't even know what to say right now. So I don't know if I've ever like really talked about this, but my mom was born and raised in Hawaii on Oahu and her whole side of the family still lives there. So we would go out there like every summer and then eventually the things started slowing down because like high school sports and college and things like that. And I would go every so often, but every single time I leave them, I seriously, it's such a tearjerker. Like it's just, oh, I get so sad. So I don't even want to think about leaving. My grandma is getting older and I haven't seen her in about three years. I am going to be heading out there just to spend quality time with family because I am working from home. So I'm still going to be working when I'm out there remotely, but this will just give me time to spend with them that I haven't been able to do in like so long. I'm going to be moving out there. I signed like a short term lease for at least a month, but we'll see. And then my family is not going to be too far. So I'll be able to have my dedicated like workspace to do work things, get some coffee, and then I'll be able to spend time with them. So I've packed up pretty much my essential life things in two luggages and we're headed out there. I don't even think I'm going to be able to sleep tonight. I'm just so excited. I was FaceTiming my cousin earlier and it just got me so much more excited. Like, I can't believe it. So I'm going to shut off for tonight and I will see you guys bright and early tomorrow morning. I hope you guys are ready for the vlogs because they're going to be so much fun. I'm gonna miss you little floof. You be good girl for grandma and grandpa? I know you won't, okay. <laughs> Goodbye, mother. We have to wait mm. for the coffee runs. I miss you. <laughs> we made it through security in like five minutes. <laughs> and now we wait for an hour. I'm sick of daydreaming I just want the feeling of you in my bed I'm down at this waistline Right below your waistline Want you by my head I'm down with all this FaceTime Need some alone time, baby You're always running in my mind I'm sick of daydreaming I just want the feeling of you in my bed 
I spent time alone Gave you my hoodie Maybe you should stay